Hello guys, it is Duct Tape and Wax. Welcome back, or Duct Tape Dreams. Uh, so welcome back to another video. This has been one of the most requested videos on the channel, and that is Duct Tape and Wax. Let's see all of your duct tape paintings. So, I can't show you guys all of them because there is quite a few. And, um, so, I just picked out like the best ones that I thought um, were the best ones. So, yep, and also I'm filming this outside again, so, Please excuse any background noise that you might hear or anything. Um, so, yeah, let's get straight into this. So, this was the first painting that I ever made. Uh, I made a time lapse on this, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Um, it is a creeper face here. Um, and actually, funny story here. This is not black duct tape. It's actually black electrical tape. Um, because I didn't have any black duct tape at the moment. Um, so... I had to use black electrical tape, but I think it still came out really, really nice. Anyways. Okay, next up here I have the little frog guy from Cut the Rope. And this was on an actual, like, real canvas. So you can see it's not on, like, the other flat canvases that I had. So it's a little bit, like, different. But, I mean, I still like the way it turned out. Um, it's not exactly clean cut. You can see it kind of, like, rips and parts and it warps here. But, I mean, I still like it. If you were to look at it from a distance and, oh my gosh, would you stop drilling? <laughs> but, yeah. So, if you were to look at it from a distance here, you could see, it, I think it looks um, really, really nice. Moving along here, you guys may have seen a painting just like this in my last other... Uh, here, let me sit down and do this, actually. It might, it's going to be easier for me. Um, okay. So, you guys may have seen something very similar to this in my last craft update video um but yes this is another invader zim one that i had made pretty recently actually um so you can see it has it's little it's still in his dog costume and everything um you see he's got a little tail and everything i even made the zipper here the zipper i i kind of failed on it but i mean i guess it's okay i mean i don't know but yeah it is clear taped um there are still like a lot of bubbles in it but if you were to look at it from a distance i just think it looked really nice as well so yeah that is this invader zim and also the trail here much more even and straight and i really really like it and oh my gosh would you please stop drilling i'm trying to record here have some respect <laughs> i love just like screaming at my neighbors and they can't hear me it's so much fun okay um okay so next i have this minecraft diamond sword and you guys may have already seen this one um, what I have to fix though is these here. See, these are kind of like uneven, so I have to fix them. But they're just a little square pieces, so I can easily fix those with just a little bit of modifying and maneuvering them around. But yeah, let me get this a little bit brighter for you guys. See, you can see that in there, and I think it looks really, really nice. And actually, now let me make it darker because now it's way too bright. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, uh, there we go. So I like that one. Next up, I have this Yoshi that I have here. Um, I think this this looks extremely clean cut. Everything looks so amazing. Um, the only thing I would have liked to see though is me put his little like knuckle lines there, so you can see. Or maybe I just could have put like some marker there to make his little like knuckle. You see those like keep this part of your knuckle and stuff. Like I would like to put some black duct tape there um uh, maybe i'll do that i'm not sure but yet but i think overall this is uh extremely clean cut and i like the way that looks next up here i have you if you follow me on instagram then you've seen this already this is the uh patrick star time lapse and also guys uh follow me on facebook twitter and instagram uh they're all in the link in the description so uh, make sure to go check me out. It's at duct tape and wax and I don't know I think I'm gonna put there's like a link somewhere up here on screen and it says at duct tape and wax But yeah, um, so yeah There we go. That's the Patrick star. I think it was also very clean cut There's just a, one or two air bubbles here and there with this one, but I mean I think overall it did come out really really nice next up here. I have it, I think it's like Tigger tiger. I, I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it's Tigger. Um so that's him there and it has it's on a yellow little square background there and it's extremely clean cut again i really like the way that this one turned out it's he's a fairly rounded character so 
and it was a bit of a challenge to actually cut him out, but I think overall it did turn out really, really nice. Next up on our list here, I have this One Direction painting, and you have no idea how many of these that I had. I literally have about eight or ten of these, of these paintings, and I just, I had to show at least one of them in the video, and a lot of them look pretty much similar. They just have like different color backgrounds and stuff and different color 1D, but they're all basically, they're so, uh, they're basically the same design. And they're, they're on different size boards and stuff, so yeah. But this is just the one that I chose to show in the video here. I really like this one. They get very clean cut and the arrow here, there's only one thing that I have. The arrow here doesn't line up exactly because it's supposed to have like the line up arrow exactly. That's the only thing that kind of bothered me. The other ones have it lined up, but oh well. I mean, it still looks really clean cut um, and everything. Next up here, this is probably my favorite one so far. This is the Instagram and Snapchat. Now, obviously with this new Snapchat logo, I'm not sure if he even has the mouth anymore. I think it's just the eyes with the new update on Snapchat, if you have the update, but I mean, yeah. But this was the old one, because this isn't like extremely old, but this was from the old update of Snapchat. Um, yeah, and then I have the Instagram over here. Two, uh, fun fact here, this is the two most popular apps. And there's a fly, I hate flies. These are the two most popular apps um, online. And I'm working on Facebook and Twitter, and then I'm gonna be doing uh, Tumblr and Vine as well. So that's just a fun fact there. Then this is just the Italian flag, or maybe this was the first, no, I think this was actually the second one that I made. Um, I just made it because it was really easy, and I don't know, I just decided to do it, because why not? Um, okay, next up here I have this Minecraft diamond. Um, if you get close up to it, man, this thing looks so ratchet. <laughs> it really does, but then when you look at it from afar, it's like, whoa, girl, that thing's cray cray, it's so good, but then when you get close up, you're like, whoa, that's ratchet, I know. I don't even know, like, it's kind of like an illusion. You can look at it from afar and be like, whoa, that's so cool. And then when you get close up, you're like, oh my gosh, never mind. I'll take that back. Okay. Uh, you've also probably seen this in my last craft update as well. This is the Rolling Stones logo. I really love this one. Extremely clean cut. I really like it. And I just really like the way that this one turned out. Next up here, I have my old Invader Zim that I had made. And let me just grab the other one and show you how much I like I've improved at making this. It's alright. There you go. You can see that. See this one was made with the lime green and this one was made with the dark green. Not really dark green, but just kinda like a darker green than the lime green. I would have preferred to see the lime green on this one though, but I just didn't want to make the two exactly the same, so I went with the other one. But yeah, so there you go. You can see how much I have actually improved on that. So here we go. This is the old one, the new one. Old one, new one. There you go, guys. So that is it. Hopefully you dudes did enjoy. If you did, make sure to smack that like button with that baka paw of yours. And I know you all got. So go ahead and smack it because this is a baka paw. No, it's a baka paw. Let me go smack it. Um, yeah. And I'll see you dudes all next time. Peace. Bye. Internet high five. Let's go.